What's behind me? What's behind me? <laughs> Is the camera straight? Never mind. Welcome back to another video! Today we're going to play a short indie horror game that is created by eight students from France. And they're from a school called Esma Game School. And this project was made in six months, so uh, I'm really looking forward to trying this game. It looks pretty cool. And here we are, all of a sudden. Welcome to Ravenous. This is a game where you play as a child who has been kidnapped by some kind of monster and we have ended up being trapped in a basement and we are going to try to find out a way to save our little sister as well. L little sister as well. <laughs> <laughs> Me and my English speaks. Why do I le never learn? Uh, I, I just don't understand. Let's jump into the game. Play. I need some coffee Five, as well. Four, three. Two, one, let's play hide and seek. Lily. Wow. Follow the train. Follow the creepy train. So here we are, mouse movement is perfect, by the way. So you get some plus points from me already, lovely students, you did a great job already. But that sequence that we just watched when being out in the woods, who the hell is going down to a hatch like that? I don't know what you call it, but some kind of basement hatch. Who the hell does that? That is so freaking stupid. You can tell that I'm a child because I'm really short. Oh, you're opening the doors for me. Thank you very much. Welcome home. What is this place? I shouldn't have come here. Well, it, apparently it's your home. Can't you read, stupid? <laughs> Mysterious disappearance of children. Disturbing testimonies. The small quiet community of Lisford has been shaken by a series of mysterious and worrying disappearance of children. What makes this case even more sinister is the growing number of reports from residents who claim to have seen a strange figure prowling the streets of the town, especially after night. No, especially at night. A shadowy, almost elusive figure who seems to be watching children playing in parks or returning home from school. Are we talking about a fucking pedophile here? <laughs> <laughs> Seriously. The descriptions were worry, were worry, worry, but one element remains constant. The sense of unease and fear felt by those who have come across this mysterious figure. Some speak of a sinister presence, others of a dangerous psychopath. And I mentioned the pedophile, that, that, that could be something too. Um, the local authorities are doing everything they can to And we can't read anymore. What? You got a fancy bottle of wine here. Can we pop that shit? Start the party for real? I love the atmosphere in this game. I must say, I really love the atmosphere. Good job. Good freaking job. A knob. Probably a doorknob. A little weird having a doorknob in a drawer like that. Maybe we're gonna find a door without a doorknob. 
Nothing in particular here. Here's some kind of key. Oh, it's for that one, of course. <laughs> Thank you very much. Is it for this door, maybe? I like it. The effect that we are actually shorter gives you a good feeling of being a little child. A little toddler prick. Just kidding, of course. Hold to grab handle. Okay, and we're gonna push it in. There we go. Uh, creepy hallway. Check. Creepy noises. Check. Pieces of a doll. Check. I'm sorry they dismembered you, but, um... Fucking hell, man. What is this place? Oh, another creepy hallway. I like this. I really like this so far. I really enjoy this. Look at that light. You're getting so drawn to it. You just want to... Imagine if you could taste the light. Just have a sip of it. That would be amazing. Wow, you can't escape. Well, you didn't really chain up the door, did you? So, f apparently, I think I can escape, actually. Let's try this one. Locked, of course. Seems too easy. That would have been too easy. Just to walk straight through the door. No, we're not gonna have a simple task like that. Do I hear flies and shit? Oh, pfft. Disgusting! Or is it my coffee breath? Maybe it's my coffee breath. Charles White, a family man, was found hanged dead in his home after a year of a family tragedy. The family's father described the sudden death as heartbreaking, as tributes will pay to him. His wife said that the loss of Charles at the age of 43 was a further heartbreak after their <laughs> had been missing for over a year. The <laughs> is believed to be dead, and at this point, there is no new information to help the search for her body. According to the testimony of Charles' son, <laughs> he had become a very distant and silent father since his tragic events. So why did you... Why have someone marked over those words? Is it the son or daughter or son and daughter, maybe? Hmm, you got something to think about there. <sighs> this newspaper, blah, 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 blah. Oh, we... Living room. We need to find a code. Oh, that's unusual for indie horror games. You need to find a code and shit. Well, I... I'm happy to look for it. Hey, is anyone here? Help. Is that reliable? Is that it, my sister? It's me, your little sister. I've Ooh. been trapped here for two years. There's something in the basement. A creature that traps and eats children. You have to help. I don't know what's up to, but you need to find a way to open my door. Please, hurry up. I don't want to die. That was a door opening by itself. That's a pure invitation to come over here. Let me kill you. And as I'm a stupid child, let's go for it. <laughs> okay, demon, come and get me. There's hanging dolls here and shit. That's lots of flies. Hello? Anyone here? Wow. A place for Lewis? No way. No fucking way! Fucking hell! Are you kidding me? A place for Lewis. Is Lewis... I'm not really sure. Is Lu... Wait, wait a minute. Let's... Did you lock the door? Fucking hell. Now I'm trapped here with all the fucking creepy dolls staring at me. Oh, no. You got any pills I can pop? That's Susie. Do we have a doll named Lois here, maybe? Can I just throw you away, maybe? 
Oscar, Hassel, Evelyn, Lois, where are you? Noah, where the fuck is Lois? Do we have a doll named Lois here? I need to find Lois. Where are you? Hmm, nothing there. Nothing in there. We got a letter to read. Let's start with that one. I'm so sorry. I never wanted you to disappear. I think a uh, birthday could end like this. Now mom cries all the time and dad doesn't talk. It's my fault, right? If only I'd pay more attention. Maybe you'd still be here with us. I don't understand why you disappeared. Mom's getting very angry with me and I'm trying to understand why. I might have deserved to disappear more than you. I feel bad. For my little sister. I miss you so much, Lois. So I am Lois. Because I'm looking for my sister. So I must be Lois? What, 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 what does this say? You never see her again? Are you fucking kidding me? No way! What if I place... What the fuck are you doing that exorcism shit with your head? Can we place all the dolls in the bed maybe? Let's give it a try. You can sit there? No? <laughs> Nothing happened. Let's try with Hazel. You seem to be a decent doll. Hello Hazel. No, didn't work either. Let's go with Noah. I can trust you Noah, can I? Come on Noah, surprise me. Thing. Okie dokie. There we have a Daisy. Are we gonna try with Daisy as well? Daisy, Daisy, give me your answer to you. You are lazy, so I'm gonna go with fuck you. I just found Lois here. You guys are screwed now. Yeah, that's right. Cry, bitch. The baby seemed to be hiding something in his head, or her head, or its head. What is that? It's a key! Lewis bedroom key! There! That was the door opening by itself again. It's never a good sign, isn't it? Let's walk out nice and slowly. <laughs> I knew something would happen. There's a fucking demon waiting for us right there. Can I just unlock the room for Lois and help my little sister or Lucy? Yeah, that's her name. Wait a minute. Lois' room. I'm sorry. That that was not... I'm, I'm sorry. Can you just wait for two more hours? I'll be there soon. I'm gonna unlock my room first. Because I still think that I'm Lois. Hey, I'm here, behind the door. I don't know where it's hiding. It could be anywhere and soon I might not be able to communicate with you. You need to keep dressing the monster's depth. There might be something crucial in this room you're in. But be cautious, I heard it's moving in the corridor. Yeah, and guess what? I fucking saw it. I saw it with my own eyes. Lewis's story. I think we have a puzzle here. What's this? A painting? Of a creepy tree? Oh, it's when we were in the woods following that train. But we didn't follow it to a tree with a hole in it. Um, okay, I guess that's it. I don't know what to do with that one, to be honest. We got a letter here. My dearest, every minute without you is difficult. I'd give anything to have you back. To hear the sound of your voice again, but you're gone. I don't know who kidnapped you. <laughs> I don't even know why. But I promised you one thing. I will find him. I'll hunt that bastard down to the ends of the earth if I have to. No one can do this to you and get away with it. And there is Lois. Every time I look at him, I can't help but feel this dull anger. 
Why do I have to watch him grow up when you're not around? You were my comfort. I know you wouldn't like it, but sometimes my anger boils over and it's him who pays the price. That's not nice. I'd give anything to take it back. Prevent it from happening. I love you, my little girl. Mom. So you fucking blame me for everything? I didn't do anything, Mom. Psycho b -b 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 bitch. Sorry, sister, the door is still locked, but I'm gonna solve the puzzle here first. Just give me a minute. Toys and shit. Oh, a drawing. Oh, it's that me and my sister playing. That's so cute. Are we gonna use it somewhere here, maybe? So, lose the story. We're gonna play some... Okay, we're gonna place the, the, the drawings in the correct order. So first, we were probably playing out in the yard, doing nothing, just chilling out, having having a good time, like kids are doing. And do we have another painting here somewhere? Nothing there, nothing there. Okay, let's see. We're gonna find another painting here. Here we have something. And then, a fucking creepy monster was luring. Oh, it's the monster steering that train. Okay, so all of a sudden, Lucy saw a train. But I don't think she saw the creature. I, I hope not, because she wouldn't follow that ugly bitch, I hope. And then... Uh, this happened. I, I, I really want to... How can I grab this one? Like that. And like that. Okay, okay. So I'm removing the arms. Simple as that. And then she ended up following the train to the forest. And felt like, oh no, maybe this is a bad idea. And uh, where's the last painting? Where's the last painting? Show it to me! Reveal yourself! Nothing there. Fuck, the door is locked. Nothing up there? No. Wait, here's something. Here we got something. That's something hiding! Oh my god! And then she was trapped by the fucking evil monster dragged down to the gates of hell. Okay, there we go. That's the story. 1988! I should talk to Lucy before I leave. I'm sorry, Lucy, but uh, screw this. I'm out of here. <laughs> it's easy for me to remember this number because I'm born in 88. That's right. Did we got any people born in 1988 here? High five to you guys. We are awesome. Louis, please listen. I remember now. I don't know what the monster is planning, but I overheard it taking my music box and blasting some keys inside it. You need to search the house, find the music box, and help me escape from here. Oh no, it's here! I have to turn off my light and stop talking, or it will kill me, or what? Tell me how to talk. Shut up I then. Need you. Please don't leave me. Find my key. Yeah, I will I I will find the key, sister. I will help you, but you need to be quiet now because the monster is inside your room. So don't forget to be quiet. I'll be back in no time. I'm so annoying. <laughs> Let's grab the handle and get the heck out of here. And we go start the beep beep. We go straight to the door with the lock. Or is it a bad idea? Fuck was that creature? Let's uh let's select the code here. 1988, bros. The best years of all time. There we go. Back when we had both Disney shirts and colorful <coughs> sorry. Colorful clothes. Oh, another creepy room. I like that. Nice place. He, di uh, she disappeared. 
because of you. That's probably my mom. She's gone raging. We need to find a music box somewhere. What's this? Birthday cake recipe for a perfect party with your family. Two ounces of cream. Three ounces of pure blood. What's this? What the fuck is this? Creepy dollhouse. Okay, I can't I, I can't live without that. What's the deal with all these creepy dolls? Ah! Oh, disgusting! What am I gonna do with the head? Why am I taking the head of a doll? Am I gonna place it on the cake? Okay, we got one head there. Guess we need to do this creepy shit in order to get somewhere in this game. You got to do some some crucial stuff in life in order to reach success. <laughs> I guess. No, I don't know what I'm talking about. This is getting so fucking creepy right now. I'm I'm kind of stressed out. It feels like that monster could arrive any minute from now. I don't want it to arrive. I don't want it to catch catch me, catch me. Seems to be locked. I must find a key. Okie dokie then. Aren't we gonna make things simple here? I guess not. Here's one of those fucking ugly telephones. Need handset. Okay, I need the handset for that toy. First I need a key for that one. Here's the key. There we go. I hope it's that easy. Yes, sir! Grab this filthy phone and use it on that one. And I have no idea what numbers to use. I think that's too soon. I think maybe we will find out from the cake or something. I, I don't know. Is that happy birthday? Yeah, that's the happy birthday song in the background. Can we go out and fight something here, maybe? No, it's locked as well. I'm actually pretty happy that you can't enter so many rooms at a time, because that could be confusing. Oh, here's the train of death! Do you have something hidden for me, you sneaky bastards? There's a doll's head. I, I should be able to grab that. Am I? But how? We got a letter to read here? Charles. I don't know how to start. But know that you're gone. I feel alone. I often wonder if there was anything I could have done to stop you from leaving. Every day is a struggle for me. Every day I have to bear the weight of the house, of responsibilities, the loss of, the loss of my poor little girl. And Lois, God knows I can't stand him anymore. I can't stand this child. I can't stand his stupidity. He doesn't understand anything and doesn't succeed at anything. I know it's wrong, but sometimes I wonder why it's my little girl who disappeared and not him. Besides, he's always looking at me strangely when I'm drinking, as if he had the slightest idea of what I'm going through. There's no one to help me. I love you and I miss you. Annabelle. So another one named Annabelle in the game, just, just that name creeps me out. It's a beautiful name, but it really creeps me out because I've been scarred for life by watching those Annabelle movies. <sighs> Apparently they didn't like the son in this family, which is us, I guess. They only liked the daughter and were missing her. Here's another freaking doll, but I can't grab that one, of course. Oh, we can look in the dollhouse from here. I had no idea. 116000. 11600000. That's the number to dial. Jesus Christ. 116000. Woo! 
Okay. Hello. You're responsible. She suffered because of you. Your mother is upset. So much suffering. You better disappear. Behind you. No way. What's behind me? What's behind me? No, no, no. What are we gonna do now? Am I just gonna run straight into your arms? Are you my father? Oh, I love you, father! Ha ha ha! Happy birthday to me! Crack that fucking head off. Let's complete this birthday cake, will we? We got one more head to go. Before that creepy creature takes us again. Hello? Happy birthday, Lucy. The missing little girl. There's no Thank way you. out. Your sister is gone. <laughs> She disappeared because of me. I've ruined my family. I must bring her back home. Come on, it wasn't your fault. Don't blame yourself for that. Is someone crying? There's something going on here. But it's locked. Don't cry, please. I'm going to try to save you. I will do my best, but I mean, there's no guarantees right now. Shit is very strange at the moment. I wonder if I'm crying or if it's my sister who's crying. Okay, now this one is open. So this is the last head. Of course, that's ugly son of a bitch. Place that on the cake. Let's celebrate! Happy birthday! Oh, we can go in there now. That's what I call a birthday gift. You are trapped here forever! Well, as long as you bring me cake, it's not that bad, to be honest. Or is it? That's a happy family right there. Maybe it's us. Hello? Charles remains here. Charles remains. Here's the music box! The music box! I must find Lucy's key! Let's do it! Let's rotate this bitch, Lucy's. Yeah, I know that, but where's the fucking key? Where is the key? We can't do anything in it? Maybe we need to do something else first. He's gone. Whoop! Someone closed the door. Okay. Charles is gone. Annabelle, it's hard to put into words the happiness I feel every day as I watch our children grow and develop. They are my reason for living, my source of joy and inspiration. The closeness between Lucy and Lois is something precious and I'm very happy to experience it as a father. I know you've been through a difficult time since Lois was born and I don't blame you, but for the sake of the family you can't go on behaving like this without a little boy. I want to find this family united, full of life and happiness. Lois will soon be six years old and I hope with all of my heart that we can celebrate this event together with joy and serenity. I love you more than anything else in the world, Charles. Oh, that's very nice. Finally, some someone who's being nice. That's something I need right now. Because everyone seems to fucking hate me. For some stupid reason. Another letter. Lots of letter in this fucking game. I'm gonna let you read this all by yourselves. There is such a sad story in this game. I feel so sorry for Lewis. I feel so sorry for him, man. Terrible. Okay, so we have chains and we have... Oh no, this is where my father hung himself. Oh, that 
that's terrible. What can we do with the music box? Come on. Look in the drawers, see if we find anything of value. Oh, of course. Ha! Ah! Jesus Christ, relax, Willie. I'm just going to play a music box. What the fuck is wrong with you guys? Let's insert it right there. There is the key we need. Lucy's bedroom key. And now we're all good, are we? No hard feelings? Son of a bitch! So that means we shouldn't go out there or... We're doing it anyway? How can we not be brutally killed already? I kind of wonder that. Wow, you, you, you made some decent decorations around here. Living room, no thank you. Oh, it's blocked here. Of course it's blocked. It's blocked to her room. We can't open that door either. Are we going into the living room again? Grab it. Open it up. Oh, what a mess. What a fucking mess in here. What did you do to this place? And why? All I wanted was a birthday party. Hello? Haha, <laughs> I took the other way, stupid demon. I oversmarted you already. Let's go and save our little sister. End this story as a true hero! Sister? L Lucy? Nice ass. <laughs> Holy shit. Student game made in six months by Ravenous team. Good job, you guys. Good job. Good job. I think this was a really good game. Wow, what can I say? I, I really enjoyed this game. This was a really good job. Made in six months only. I'm actually really impressed. And I really hope that you enjoyed this video. I hope you enjoyed the game overall as well. And uh, let me know what you think in the comment section below. And don't forget to smash the like button, subscribe to the channel. And I will truly hope that I will see you in the next video, of course. Till then, take care. Bye-bye.